Hello everyone, I'm going to be showing you the best Discord bots that you could use in your Discord server for the year 2025. This video will be broken up into different categories. This will include, but not limited to, moderation bots, server associated bots, and fun bots. And of course, this video is completely my own opinion on some of the best bots that you could use currently this year. This is updated. I noticed that there hasn't been a video on the best Discord bots for your server recently, and I noticed in those videos they mention bots that are either no longer available or they just are not worth actually getting. For example, the Me6 bot is no longer one of the best Discord bots. If you aren't aware, they have added a lot of paid features to basically everything that they offer. And the thing is, pretty much, there's quite a few other bots out there that offer the same exact stuff that they do, if not more. So it's just one of those things that has changed. Now you probably already know that, but I just wanted to give an example because there are bots like that. So I want to make sure that this tutorial is very updated so you know exactly which Discord bots are the best right now. So the very first moderation bot we're going to look at is the Dinobot. Now this bot I would say is one of the top bots in terms of it offers everything you'd ever need with moderation. And of course it's all down to preference. And by the way, the next moderation bots that I list off, these can all be traded out for each other. They're all very, very good. And they offer pretty much mostly the same stuff. It really does comes down to preference in which, you know, which bots you actually uh, like to use. So just an example, the Dino bot offers a lot of different uh, things that most moderation bots offer. They offer the, you know, the action log, they offer auto moderation, auto rolls, moderation commands, custom commands, welcome channels, uh, reaction rolls, reminders, and a lot more. They even actually offer some fun commands as well uh, that will be, I guess, an addition to other fun bots that I'll be listing later on. As well as you could go in deep into their commands and basically edit whatever you like. And just, there, there is so many different commands to go over, so I've, I'm, I'm not going to go every, so, every single one. Obviously, I'm just re recommending this bot. Uh, but there is a lot of different commands, and you could go into the deep settings of all the commands to edit uh, which uh, channels and roles can actually use them. And as well as you could turn some off if you only want this bot for certain purposes. Uh, but overall, though, this bot is one of the top, if not one of the... Uh, mod moderation bots uh, that Discord currently has, and the Dino bot has been on this, um, I guess you'd say the best Discord bots list for quite a while, if not forever. Uh, so this is one of those ones uh, that you should use. The next bot on this list has got to be the Sapphire bot. Now this bot has actually been popping off pretty recently. This bot wasn't that big a couple years back. Like it wasn't, it wasn't really out there really. I would say, and not many people were using this bot, but now this bot is. I would say one of the top three bots ever on Discord right now. Like, the the UI is very very simple, especially compared to Dino. It's it's actually a lot more straightforward to, especially for a new user that hasn't used bots before. Very very uh, user friendly, and I really like how they have everything set up here. I think it offers probably the exact same stuff that uh, Dino does. I don't think there's anything more or less that they add. It's pretty much pretty much the same. Uh, the only difference is the UI, of course, in their uh, uh, dashboard on their website is a lot better than Dino's. I would personally say Dino's is a lot more smaller text. You know, you have to really read. Uh, but this one's really like straight to the point. And you can still just uh, go just as deep as uh, Dino does. As well as, I don't know if Dino offers this, but they also have the channel locking feature, which I think is pretty cool. Uh, where you can basically lock all your channels to uh, prevent raids. So I think that's a really cool... Uh, feature that you should definitely have in your discord server uh, but overall though i mean sapphire is one of the bots if you don't have sapphire well you better have dino or some other type of moderation bot that i list because if you don't you're probably not running your discord server too well because this is one of these crucial type of bots that you kind of you know that you really need for your server if you really want to uh, to run your server properly the third and final moderation bot that i want to mention in this video is the Carabot, the good old turtle. This guy is one of the older bots in Discord. You can see it's an 11 million servers, so it's very, very uh, known, I guess you could say. And it has a lot of different features. It actually has more than, I think, some other things. Like, they got this Carl Gaming documentation. We could get notifications for free games. That, that's very unique. I don't think the other bots offer that. Uh, and But this bot has been out for quite a while, probably as long as Me6 has. 
um, so that could be a reason why, but it does have a lot more things uh, that the other moderation bots don't offer. Uh, the UI is pretty average, it's both the same, you could think of that uh, Dino has, pretty similar. A lot, of, a lot of things to read here, so it's, you know, if you want to be more technical with it, uh, you could use this bot. Uh, but this, of course, this is a great bot to use. Like, it, it is it, it is a really good bot. Like, it has everything that you need, that you'd want, and that you'd ever use for your Discord server. And it's a little bit more of a read. It's actually, I would say, it's out of the three bots, it's probably the one that you have to really um, take time to, uh, to actually look into. Because their documentation site is really long as well. Uh, but for the most part, it's pretty straightforward. It's not too much harder than Dino. And it has pretty much everything that it offers, if not more, than Dino offers. But anyways, though, the Carl bot, once again, I would say top three uh, moderation bots out there. If you don't include uh, Sapphire and Dino. Um, so out of these three, I would choose whichever one you like. Personally, out of the three of them, I would say Sapphire. If you're, uh, if you're really wanting to start your own Discord server, I would choose Sapphire. Just because of its uh, really useful UI. Uh, but other than that though, they all work the exact same pretty much. They all have really good features. They each have their own unique features too between them. Uh, so it's all your preference on which one you want to use. Or you could even use multiple. Now there's nothing wrong with using multiple moderation bots for different purposes. Uh, to make it more easier to you know organize with bots. What, what bot does what you know. Uh, but in the end though, these three bots, really good moderation bots. Solid, just solid bots to use any of them are fine once again all these bots will be in the description below so you can see them all they'll all be organized by category uh so you'll know and there'll also be the website to them as well uh so you could add them to your discord server now moving on to the server associated bots i want to start this one off with uh yeg pdb i've already gone over this bot about two three times already in previous videos and i just think it's a really good um self rolls bot to use it's also it also does moderation so you can use it as a moderation bot as well uh, but for the most part most people use this bot um, for their self roles it's kind of what it started as and kind of you know and then they sort of grew to a moderation bot uh, but I'm mentioning this in the server associate bots just for that sole reason of the whole self roles thing and they do offer um, if I go to the control panel here and as you can see they do offer you know verification as well. Uh, which is another very important thing when you're setting up your server is having a verification system uh, such as a captcha or some other type of like role other role verification role or something like that um not every single bot I'm, I'm not sure if the other moderation bots that i mentioned actually has this and this is why that i'm putting this inside of the server associated bots because a lot of servers do need a verification uh system in their server to verify members as well as of course a self role section which of course we've probably all done before but if you haven't done it i do have videos on this bot as well that i'll have linked in the description below but anyways that is why i wanted to mention this bot because it's really good uh, for those two key reasons verification and self roles the next bot that i wanted to mention here is the ticket tool bot now previously i've made a video actually on the tickets bot uh but if you didn't know, as of recently, uh, March 5th, 2025, uh, they actually ended their support for the bot. As you can see, on the 5th of March, 2025, they uh, discontinued the bot just because it was a solo dev that was working on it and he couldn't run it uh, anymore. And that's why it was closed. Um, so I will have to create a new video on the tickets or the ticket toolbot, which I haven't done yet, but I will be making one soon. Uh, but overall, though, this is the bot that you'll want to use for tickets. I would have suggested both of these guys, but sadly, this one is now discontinued, so we cannot use this one anymore. Uh, so you have to use the Ticket Tool one. But nonetheless, though, Ticket Tool is still the number one ticket bot uh, between the two anyways, um, so that's not a bad choice. And we could see that there's a lot of different uh, customization that you could do with this tickets, and you can see... Um, the system that they use here you you know you create a kit ticket and then you could close it afterwards and the channel when you want to and overall though it's a great bot if you want to one if you want to have staff applications or if two maybe you want to you know have a ticket or like a support ticket so people could ask uh, for help in your discord server for whatever reason that you want to set the third and final bot for the server associated bots that i want to mention in this video is the arcane bot now this bot has been mentioned in some older tutorials about a year back and two years back now this bot is still by far the best leveling uh leveling bot on discord there is nothing else better than this bot 
there are other bots that have levels uh, that they offer but overall this is I'm, I'm saying the best I've used this forever since I've started making discord servers and it still continues to be the best leveling bot previously this title would have gone to me six uh, but ever since me six basically made everything ever all of their stuff paid even their leveling system everything literally everything paid content uh, it's basically completely out of the picture now and arcane takes the top number one spot for the best leveling bot for your discord server if you don't know what leveling is it's you know if you've ever been in a discord server and they have leveling roles like level 25 you know level 80 whatever it is level 5 and you have like perks for those levels that's all done with this bot here it, you know it gives you the levels at certain uh, xp marks it gives you the roles associated with those levels as well as you could have premium and get bonus features that you could do such as change you know background colors and all that but overall though this is the leveling bot for your discord server so i highly recommend to get this bot if you don't already have it in your server the next bot on this list is the legendary dank memer bot this bot is a classic discord bot this bot feels like it's been around since the dawn of time and it really has it's been basically the best fun bot on discord and it's never really gone out of that rank it's always been the top you know fun bot uh where you could do anything you want on discord and it literally says here the largest indie game on discord which is definitely a true statement it, it really is and if you don't have this bot well you should probably get it because there's so many different things it's almost like having gta but in a bot form kind of thing like you could rob people and work and make money and all that stuff it's all you could really ask for for a discord bot in terms of activity wise um but overall though this thing this bot is still in the top uh for fun bots it hasn't really changed and this bot of course is on today's list and i do highly recommend it as well as i have a, a tutorial on this bot as well which will be linked with the dank memer title in the description below the next fun bot that i want to mention of course is the counter bot i feel like this bot is so underrated it's only in 121,000 uh, servers but i feel like this should be probably in the top you know in terms of fun bots it should be in the top five top ten i would say uh because it's just one of those things like as you can see it's it's for a counting channel if you've ever used a counting channel before in a server this is kind of the bot for counting if you ever want to have a counting channel in your server uh so i highly recommend this bot i also have a video on this on how to set it up as well uh that i'll link in the description below and overall it's just a really fun bot especially if your server is not too active or there's not too many members this is a great way of making those you know not active members a little bit more active because they could actually interact with each other in a fun way uh, without it being you know without it getting dull or boring because you're just counting up but you're taking turns so it makes it more interactive and fun the next fun bot will be the giveaway bot now this is kind of a crucial bot to most discord servers is you want to host giveaways on your discord servers most discord servers do host giveaways in some form whether it be currency in a video game or roles on the discord server or server levels or discord nitro or robux or whatever it may be so many things you can give away really anything you want uh, but overall this is i would say one of the if not the uh, giveaway bot in discord currently and it probably will always stay the same it's just it's literally just called giveaway bot it's the bots that you want to use when you're hosting your discord giveaways i do also have a video on this uh, on how to set it up but this bot's very straightforward you basically invite the bot and you use it's like two commands that it has there's not really much to it because you're just creating a giveaway at the bot and the giveaways that's about it there's not really uh there's not a whole lot it's just you know it's it's for giveaways that's it you can see this is actually this is the whole command list here there's not a lot to do with it uh but it's just to manage your giveaways uh in your discord server the very last fun discord bot that i want to mention in this video is the fred boat music bot now it used to be rhythm that used to be the sort of the top number one music bot on discord uh, but now that title sort of have gone to has gone to fred boat because rhythm is no longer really a discord bot it's sort of like an in uh, built-in activity on discord which is kind of weird because they were doing really successful so it's kind of weird how they shut it down and then kind of reopened it really weird but overall if you want just an actual bot in your server which you can invite to your vcs and stuff to play music uh, i would say fred boat is probably the choice for that option and once again, I will have a video for this in the link in the description below uh, that I've created as well on how to set it up and use the bot uh, to play music. Uh, but overall, this is the bot that you should be using if you are playing music in your Discord channels. Anyways, guys, that is sort of my guide to the best Discord bots that you could be using in your Discord server in 2025. And I think there's definitely other bots out there that are really worth checking out as well. 
but these are just some of the ones that are like sort of it's sort of like if you looked at a long list of bots these are like i would say the top 10 out of all the categories uh that you'd probably ever come across and use in your discord servers and that's why i highly recommend that at least you get a couple of these bots in your server if you don't already have any of them already uh because they're just that good and they do so much for your server that you don't have to be doing if you are doing them uh, especially moderation wise and whatnot and it just makes it a whole lot easier if you have at least a couple of them in your discord server um, to make things run more smoothly and overall make the experience for your users a lot better please subscribe to my youtube channel i really want to get to 2,000 subscribers now and once again thank you for 1,000. that means a whole lot to me and it's really nice to see that my community is growing and people are interested in learning how to make uh, really good discord servers for their discord communities and it's really nice to see the feedback uh, that i am getting on my videos because it helps me create better videos in the future as well as to inform you guys on things that you want to be informed of uh, especially on things that are related to discord so anyway guys please subscribe and please leave a like on this video and i will see you guys in the next discord tutorial Bye bye